no, no. What just came up today? What just came up? Hmm. I don't know. Well, I don't. I really don't know. Well, of course, we're talking about the man, the myth, the legend, Zack Snyder himself. Zack fucking Snyder, buddies. All right. What's up? What's up, legend? We were starting to miss you, man. But luck. But luckily, you came out with a new trailer, and you're creating your own universe, man. Yes, sir. Proud yes, sir. Of you, bro. Yeah, and apparently, good news, he and the rest of the cast of Rebel Moon is going to be presenting themselves at the convention at C... Uh, I forgot where it's going. Somewhere in Los Angeles. Yeah, I'm like, God damn it, it, why can't you come here to Boston, buddies? Or New, or New York, so we could probably travel over there sometime. I'll call out if it was in New York. Yeah, definitely. I would definitely do that. But uh, yeah. the last I heard, like they were doing some screenshot showing. Bro, I really hope we get screenings. If not, Please. I'll definitely pay... My ticket seats to go see it in theaters. Come on, do do what you did with Glass Onion, man. Come on, we want to see it. I want to see it in theaters because it looks big screen. The last yes, the last chair looks like it belongs in theaters. Hey, here's the thing, though. After we react to see that, I've been doing some more digging, and apparently, I don't know if it's true. Allegedly, Zack Snyder probably would not want to have this movie be in theaters. He would like to prefer it be on Netflix side. So I mean, I'm, I mean, I'm okay with that, but uh, but I'm, but still, personally, I would have loved to see it in theaters, you know, like what they did with Glass Onion and a few other movies. But uh, I yeah, we'll go see it like five times. But hey, I guess uh, watch it on in my house would be would be pretty cool. Oh hell yeah! So you guys ready? Yes, sir. You ready? Yes, I'm ready. Yes. Hell yeah! Okay, ready? Three, Three two, two, one. one. When I found you in the wreckage of that ship. I considered leaving you. I was afraid you could bring trouble to us. What do you think they want? What's up, Green Arrow? Small fee, obviously. Hey, hey. I'm a queen. You don't want to hold on. I'm here to make you an offer. I give you a chance at redemption. We are beyond redemption. Show me the lightsabers. Where are the lightsabers? This isn't just the suit of revolution. Let's go. Lightsaber, let's go! I have found her. The most wanted fugitive in the known universe. Where's Ray Fisher? We just saw him. There yeah! Let's go! That's my cyborg. It's a new age for the universe. Part one, Child of Fire. That was fucking fire, bro. Dude, that was awesome. Shit, man. All right, Zach. Man, can I call you Zach? God damn, man, you're friggin' you just showed a bit more of the plot but not too much i'm guessing there's more to the story with most of these characters actually and another thing they actually showcase a bit more of the characters most importantly ray fisher's character fuck yeah yes 
But uh, oddly, he didn't get a word. But I'm okay. I'm okay with that. I'm fine with that. Also, I'm not sure if that character was his sister or not. It looked like it though, but he might have had a sister. Imagine if, if the ways in what. <laughs> If one of the reasons this was meant to be a Star Wars film because they were gonna do the whole oh, yeah. um, <laughs> you, you know what I'm talking about. Us, you know what I'm thinking about. You know what I'm thinking about. Us Star Wars fans are still scarred by the thing. Okay, Dude, let's not talk about. Hey man, you brought it up. <laughs> but uh, but no, I meant like just his sister or wife. Either way, I don't know what what that character is to Bloodax, but that's the character named Bloodax. I don't know who she is to him. But I guess we're gonna have to find out in the movie when it comes out next month. Next month, bro. Hey, can can it be a little sooner? Like, can we get a like a, a, a can we get like a Thanksgiving screen or something? I mean, if we did, I wouldn't drop this reaction. I would. Yeah, yeah, of course not. But uh, man, you know, you just make you make come on, you make us extreme, you make us extremely excited to see it. Next month is gonna be crazy. They're really trying to drop a lot of good stuff next month. But come on, can we get some more lightsaber battles? They're saving it, they're saving it, man. Just be patient. They're saving it, bro. Oh man, you you have no idea freaking how hard it is to freaking not geek out what when it comes to lightsabers. And when you watch like uh, of course uh, you know Disney and shit, but uh, fuck that right now. But uh, when you see Star Wars and you see the lightsaber battles, it's like one of the coolest things you'll ever see, bro, because you it's like not many times you're ever gonna see people fighting with laser swords. Now, because of you know Disney, it's freaking everywhere, and like a lot of people are getting tired of seeing them. But not us true fans. We're still here, and we're still watching the lightsaber battles. Yeah, lightsabers have to be the coolest fucking weapon ever, ever to imagine. Even and the fucking force. Even if uh, Rick and Morty made it made it look extremely dangerous, but uh. But uh, we're not thinking about that, we're thinking about how awesome they are. Man. They even made it uh, like 10 times more awesome here. Yeah, 10 times, it's extremely cool to see. But uh, so far, for the, for the plot, like I said before, one character who was a child of war, she was, she uh, fought, she fought in, in like, so many that she scarred, she wanted to retire. But now her home is being threatened. Now she gotta go get other soldiers, other enemies of the quote empire. I I, don't, I still don't know what the name of the, the empire is, but we'll, but we'll figure it out. But how do you guys feel about the looks of the characters? Amazing. It, it really would help out a lot that all the characters don't look the same and not wearing the same like armor or whatever, <laughs> because you you can be able to tell them apart. Because trust me, bro. As a noob, I'm gonna be forgetting their names from time to time. I might even just refer to them by their by the actual actor's name, <laughs> like yeah, Ray Fisher. Yeah, we'll, 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 we'll figure out yeah, the characters' names. Yeah, I'm a genius. Yeah, I'm a genius. That's what I like to be too to this. I mean, in Maybe, a way, so yeah, are you. you. See, you know, see, the thing is, this is a new story, something brand new for all of us to see. And uh, it would have been awesome if freaking Zack Snyder had the same Disney budget behind it, so he can actually do something special. Because, you know, a lot of us wanted something new when it came to Star Wars. Now we're just getting a whole lot of nostalgia bait from Star Wars at, at this moment. Well, with but, the uh, exception of um, with Andor. Andor, Mandalorian, you know, a couple, few things. But, like, most of it, when you see in there, it's, like, a lot of nostalgia bait. Yeah. But, like, at this point, the Zack Snyder, he stated he wanted to do something new. You know, he wanted new characters. He wanted, like, you know, but he still wanted to use the Empire and stuff. But for the most part, it would have been a whole new story. It would have been dope to see. That's why I wish Alex was here so, like, you know, like me and him can talk about how crazy Star Wars is. Maybe we could save that for the movie review if we shall be blessed to get to see it in theaters. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We can also uh, do a review for that. Yeah. Yeah. Alex is also decided to go there. Hell yeah. But I got a question for you now. Mm -hmm. Do you even have any gripes on this trailer? Gripes? Not many. Oh, except you do have some. Not many gripes. I mean, I wish we got to see more of Ray Fisher's character. Yeah. And uh, but but like, there That's is something name. there is something I can tell you that is pretty unique. So you know how in most movies, like all the bad guys look the same. They're wearing the same uniforms. Yeah. You actually point to like something close to this out. But in this case, they're not all the same. 
you see like the people who are like rate who are like raiding the farms and shit. Yeah. Are like they don't they're not wearing military military uniforms. They're not wearing like you know the same shit all the time. They're not wearing stormtrooper uh, armor. They're just wearing you know regular like friggin' mercenary mercenary clothing. Like they're breaking in the houses and they're wearing uh, soldier gear, just like pushing people around. And the only one to fight back is that girl. Yeah. You know, that's actually something new when it came to this, as opposed to just the army all dressed up the same way, just the same exact robots and destroying everything. That, that was actually cool to see. Enough of, our, enough of my babbling. Ant, what do you give this trailer? Yeah, and we have to say. I give this trailer 4.5 out of 5. Alright, now that you... 4.5 out of 5. It needs more Ray Fisher. Hmm? I, also, I also agree. I agree. Uh, more, more Ray Fisher. You know, more of the other characters. I would love to know more about them, especially Nemesis with the lightsabers. Yeah, yes. she's cool. I want to know more about her too. Yes. She gives me. Uh, I'm uh, sorry she, to compare, but she gives me a lot of vibes from Kamiko from The Boys. I don't know why. Really? Nah, mostly because she's mostly silent. Yeah, but uh. And Asian, but <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. that's why I didn't want to. That's, 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 that's neither here nor there. I didn't want to be basic about that. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Yeah, come on, come on, you know how to jab right that right in there. But uh, yeah, same thing. I give this a uh, four point five out of five. You know, I wish we had more of uh, more of the other characters instead of like the one. But she's the star. We'll give her her spotlight. And part two comes out in April, right? Yeah, I think uh, what's that? Twenty twenty four. Yeah, yeah. Alright guys, uh, enough of that. And thank you guys so much for watching. If you didn't like, comment, subscribe, and click that bell to get notified for our new video. Share this video with anyone else that's hyped to see Rebel Moon the next month because you already know birdies we are for sure. Alright, and uh, remember, may the force be with you. Yeah. Yeah.